So during International Women's Day, Guinea decided to, you know, celebrate women who own their tap with no apologies. Glasses were raised in honor of women to celebrate Happy International Women's Day with the woman. And the hashtag that Guinness used was I choose you child. I choose to challenge. Sorry. And of course, being an ambassador, we saw Nengi feature in the campaign and we saw snippets of um, the video. So here I am to drop the full video for you. So in dropping the video, Nengi captioned it like this. I like what I like. Being a queen is more than just mere words and paparazzi. It's about being 100% confident in who you are at every moment. No stories, no second guesses, no apologies. And this was the hashtag that Guinness used. I choose to challenge. So here we see Nengi talk about herself big brother jenny and also shoes by flora and um she being a humanitarian and, and also being an ssa um to the bielsa state government and uh, i'm here to drop the video for you guys to watch let me know what you think of this interview let's have a little chit chat down below thank you so so much if you're new here kindly subscribe every time subscriber the love is deep shot thank you for always coming to watch my videos enjoy no pressure remove the goal is to work harder always to remain the blueprint. Every day is an opportunity to showcase that I'm more than my face. It's your choice. Own it like a queen. No apologies. Nengi is a whole lot. I don't even know where to start from. Nengi is a businesswoman. I own a shoe line, Shoes by Flora. Nengi is a humanitarian. And I'm also a government appointee, senior special assistant to the governor of Bielsa State. So um, I'm a handful. <laughs> I'm a whole lot. I feel like a lot of people just see a fine girl and feel, oh, she's just fine, she gets things easy, but they don't know how much work I have to put in. It's probably 11 p.m. and I've had two shoots today, I've been working all day, but people don't see it. So when I ran for Big Brother, I told people that I want the world to see me, to see the real me, to see what's inside, because people just see, you know, the physical appearance and they just assume what they want to assume. I wanted to be that girl that will come on the show and prove that you can be more, we're way more than what people perceive us to be. So I feel like to an extent I achieved what I wanted to achieve. I'm a pretty girl who knows what she wants and will go for it. <laughs> when people see me drink beer, I'm not I like what I like, that's it. But uh, a lot of people just feel like, mm, as a girl, you're supposed to be bougie. That's definitely not me. So if it's beer I want to drink, I'm going to drink beer. I remember the first day in Big Brother, and I went straight to the fridge, took my beer, and people were looking at me like, what's, what's wrong with this girl? A lot of people feel like they need to have an opinion about what you do with your life. I try to take the love in and not pay attention to trolls because why would I pay attention to faceless people? There's a lot of beautiful people who don't get the opportunity to achieve what they want to achieve. Everybody should just pray for grace in my opinion. I don't know about anybody else, but for me, grace and hard work.